What's up everyone? How are you today? It is Thursday and we are here um, because Gaunt, uh, uh, Gauntlet, <laughs> Kingdom Wars started today, you know, the event with the, the hexagons, and we are figuring out uh, what this raid button is all about. Uh, we knew it was coming, but seeing the numbers, actually adding, doing the math, uh, has been something that I wanted to take you all through and to just see how, what is the benefit of using this raid button. Now, right now we are doing it based off of the discounted numbers. So according to the blog post from Pocket Gems, we, will, uh, we are getting a discount for this event and we next event, the discount will kind of go away, changing the numbers and changing the value of rating. Um, that said, we will address that when those time when that time comes uh, in two weeks. Uh, right now, we're going to take it based off the discount. I wanted to get this video out for you all so that you could make uh, calculated decisions of how you are choosing to attack, whether that be uh, using regular attacks, supers, uh, raiding, what have you. So let's hop into it right now. The first thing we're going to talk about is. Uh, attacking with just regular attacks, no raiding at all. Um, I know the, the 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 headline says raid cost breakdown, but this is just for regular attacks. All right. So each attack is going to be uh, four energy. We're going to use three inner fires. Every every consideration that I'm doing here is going to take in inner fires into consideration. Uh, the math actually becomes a lot easier when you when you remove inner fires from the equation. So if you are doing uh, inner fire non inner fire attacks, it actually becomes uh, slightly better, and we can get into maybe those numbers at some other time. But I wanted to do it with inner fires because that's actually the more complex of the math uh, based off of what the math I was doing. So uh, four energy for three inner fires. You do that ten times and you get a wildfire attack, right? You get a bonus attack for, um, a bonus attack to use. So if we are taking into consideration that this is, for example, on Gustav, right? Uh, 125 for the top four, uh, for the top four bases. Now, each one uh, you can do, you can rate up to a whole bunch of times. We're gonna only take into account uh, rating three times. So two, three, and then four energy costs. So equal, equal energy costs. Um, the more you raid, the, 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 the different numbers you're going to get. Um, and, and it's going to change the, the entire thing. So if we, uh, do four attacks, 10 times, we're going to, uh, get our wildfire each attack. And, and we use three inner fires on each, each attack is going to be 500 points. So 10 times, that's going to be 40 energy and 5,000 points. We're going to get an extra thousand points using uh, three dragons with inner fires on them for that attack as well. Again, this is on the same level base. We're, we're, we're taking the points kind of out of the equation. So all in all, we'll end up with 6,000 points and that's going to come out to 150 points uh, per one energy that you're that you're using. So uh, the second the second option is um, using regular attacks, and then after you do the first four, so you hit uh, 125, 125, 125, 125, and then it goes down to 110, um, and, a, and a several bases at 110. It's at that point. Uh, we're going to just then switch to after the 125s. We're just going to switch to doing regular attacks to finish up the uh, wildfire. So at that, it's going to be uh, we're going to hit the first base for four energy with three inner fires, and that's going to be 500 points. Uh, and then with, for two energy, we're going to be able to raid and add one inner fire, and that's going to be 250 points. And then we'll do that again for three energy and we'll do it again for four energy. And all in all, that's going to net us 1,250 points. All right, for 12 energy. Not too bad, not too shabby. Uh, so we do that four times, right? The top four bases again. Uh, we're gonna get 5,000 points from that for 48 energy. And here's the thing. Uh, 
<laughs> because the other one, because the other, um, just the regular attacks does include the wildfire, we need to include, uh, somehow we need to figure out how to include that wildfire here um, in, in my thought. I, I wanna make sure to include that. So we're, we're kind of boosting up the amount of energy we're spending, um, but to get a little bit more even uh, breakdown, okay? So, uh, we do six more attacks with three inner fires each to finish up. Um, again, on the 125 basis. So we're not dropping down to the 110s. We're doing those six attacks uh, on the 125, just regular attacks, three inner fires equipped, etc. 24 energy for each one, 3,000 points. Uh, so 24 energy, five, five, uh, 100 points per um, six times equals 3,000 points. Then we have equipped, or how we have unlocked our wildfire, and we do that and for a total of 9,000 points. Um, and we've done that all for 72 energy. So we've saved a little bit of time. And for our time, we have, uh, we get 125 points per energy spent. So a little bit less than the overall cost of, or the overall benefit of just doing a regular tax. But, you know, we, uh, we've, we've gotten, um, we've gotten the ability to get one more points out of it and in two in a faster amount of time. So three, we go third scenario, we go to supers and this is doing uh, super attacks and then supers till you wildfire. So six more, essentially six more super attacks. Uh, pretty, pretty simple breakdown here. Similar thing, 20 energy plus three inner fire, that's 875 points. Then 250, three times um, for the two, uh, three and four rating options. Each one equipped with an inner fire. That's for 20, 29 energy. That's gonna get us 1625, 1625 points, all right? And uh, the breakdown of the, let's see, the breakdown, uh, that actually might not be right. I might have made a typo. One, six, two, five divided by 29. That is 56. So this actually should be 56 points per energy and that, that would uh, stay the same here. Uh, my bad, I can make sure, I'll, I'll make sure to fix that. Uh, so. All in all, we come out of it. The, the points at, at, at remain the same though. So it comes out to 12,750 points for 236 energy. That equates to 54 points per energy spent, per one energy spent. Uh, not great. So by switching to doing supers, uh, we end up Obviously, we get more points. Again, 3,000 more points from uh, from the rating plus regulars. But now we have, again, um, again, we are saving time for uh, what could have been more valuable, uh, more value per energy spent if we had that extra time. All right. And the last scenario is going to be kind of a hybrid scenario. And so that is going to be one starting off with one super attack, doing the rating, and then regulars till you till you wildfire. So again, these uh, these averages are um, incorrect. Uh, they should be the 56 uh, points per energy, like I said earlier. That said, um, everything else here is correct. So you, you give up a few points, but you're spending way less energy for it, all right? Uh, basically the change comes here where we're spending only 24 energy for the 3,000 points to hit the wildfire um, all in all getting us 10,500 points for 140 energy so almost a hundred hundred less energy right uh, almost uh, yeah almost exactly a hundred less energy so all that said when you look at the different numbers um, it's going to vary in real life because we're all every one of these scenarios is taking um, just a, a base worth 125 points and a base that we know we can beat 
with uh, three dragons every time equipped with inner fires. In real life, you might be hitting a 400 that's worth 122 points. And then the next one that you can hit is maybe a lot lower than that. And maybe only worth 112 points or something like that. Maybe, maybe, it's, maybe it's not so drastic. Maybe it's 115. But that's going to skew the numbers in a lot of different ways. It's going to be better to raid that higher, um, higher number until if, if at least till equal until you uh then attack the lower one uh, because that the rating you're doing at a higher value so it does change when you get into real life scenarios another thing that it doesn't take into account is how fast rating can be done um, potentially uh getting a whole bunch of targets raid ready uh, and then going to a monument and everyone raiding at one time all the targets that they have set and uh, really boosting their points very very quickly on that monument um, so th different things like that but but at the end of the day raiding does come at a, a time uh, it, it comes at a time value for energy cost uh, so we don't get because we can't equip three inner fires we don't get the total value as if we did a normal raid uh, or a normal attack all in all um, I think raiding is really cool. It's a great time saver. It's better than doing just supers. So that's that's awesome. But at the same time, if you have the ability to sit down and do a whole bunch of regular attacks, that's going to be your best bang for your buck. I hope this video helps you um, and just helps you figure out where you want to spend your resources how, resources, how you want to spend those resources, and when you want to use that rating function and when not. Thank you so much for tuning in. Make sure to like and uh, subscribe. I will see you next time. Peace.